Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm just going to be doing a little vlog because um, I've had a pretty exciting day and I just want to share it with you guys. So um, I decided to go shopping today so I'm just going to show you like a few random things that I decided to buy because why not. So I went to um, Winners. Um, or home sense, whatever. And it's kind of like a TJ. No, it's not like a TJ Maxx, I don't think. <laughs> Anyways, um, I got two essential oils. Um, I do have a diffuser, and I do really enjoy it. And I really enjoy essential oils. Um, one of my teachers actually got me really into them, and she's really educated on that type of stuff, and she's really into healthy you know, things and natural healing remedies and stuff like that. So, um, in class she would, um, sometimes diffuse some oils and my favorite one is orange and it's supposed to help reduce anxiety and yeah, I really loved it so I decided to pick one up and it's just this, um, yeah. And then I got this one. Um, this, the orange one is by Potions and Possibilities, and it's just sweet orange essential oil, um, 100% pure. And then, this one is Eco Aroma, or Aroma, and it's called Head Calm Essential Oil Blend. And this is a mix of orange, lavender, thyme, and camel chamomile, I don't know how to say that, cam oil, no, whatever it is, but, um, yeah, this is made in Australia, cool, and this one is made in the UK, I got, I'm really excited for this, I got a squishy, and it's so cute and squishy, obviously, um, it looks like this, and it's so soft and it's slow rising and I love it. It's so cute. So I got that. And then my um my dad actually bought me that, but anyway. Um and then I got a new um sponge for makeup because mine was garbage. <laughs> um this is just the real techniques um perfect complexion sponge or miracle complexion sponge, I guess it's called. Um, yeah, I was going to get the Eco Tools new sponge, but I couldn't find it anywhere, so I just stuck with this one. So, bought a couple of slime supplies. I bought some foam balls, and I've seen um, people kind of shave these with um, a cheese grater, and it kind of creates like the fake snow type of thing. So, I just wanted to test that out because. It isn't winter time, so it's really hard to find, like, fake snow. So I bought those. And then I also just bought a new cheese grater so that I'm not, like, using the same one that we actually um, use cheese for. Um, oh, yeah. My dad and I got new toothbrushes, but that's side the point. Um, I also got these um, confetti glitters. So there's, like, flowers. Just, like party they're kind of like party ones but whatever and then I also got a little mirror that really magnifies everything hey so yeah I got that for my makeup oh the I also bought this little Shopkins thing for um the little boy I babysit well my dad bought me this new shirt from H&M and I think it's really cute so this is a shirt. It just has little cactuses on it and it's really cute. And yeah. It's really like flowy and I don't know. I just really liked it. Now for the best part. <laughs> I'm really excited. Like I never thought like I've, I'd ever have this in my life. But I'm like really happy right now. Like I just don't even know. <laughs> but my dad bought me two little rats. <laughs> and I know, like, a lot of people, like, 
think of rats as like gross and mean animals and stuff like that and I mean I've never been I never really had any thoughts on rats I just never like thought I'd ever get one as a pet but um I went to the animal store the pet store and I knew I wanted a little pet just like a little thing and at first I was gonna get this little hamster but the guy that worked at the pet store was super educated and super informative and he's so helpful and he really recommended rats that they're the best like animal for if you just want a little friend to like hold and pet and cuddle with and they don't bite and they don't hurt you and they're really loyal and they're actually like really good pets so I got two so because if you only get one the, then it will typically get very lonely and they can actually get depression and die from it and I was like oh my gosh <laughs> but I got two rats and I'm like really like I don't even know but I'm gonna show you them so they're still kind of like hiding because I just you know set everything up and they're still a little scared so we just got this little one and I'm gonna save up for the big one and get that in a couple months because they're still little babies I mean they're not super tiny but they are still young and so we just got this cage and then we got the little water bottle and this is a little ceramic dish for their food so I have you know just regular dry food and then I have I put some apples and green pepper um, in there and then their bedding is this um, it's actually like cat litter but it's just recycled paper so yeah and then this is just a little tree trunk house but I got two boys and one's name is Dumbo and one's name is Joseph and I'll tell you why so funny story like literally like maybe like 30 minutes not even before we went to the pet store we were in the mall and um if you guys know those little pop figures um I don't know how to explain it but it's just a little figure and I was like if you guys don't know I mean you probably don't because I've never really <laughs> told the internet but I love elephants they're my all-time favorite animal and I could show you I have so many different elephants like I have a little shelf full of just little stuffed animal elephants I have little like ceramic ones on my shelf I have little I have just elephants everywhere like I'm obsessed like they're my favorite thing ever and so I was gonna look for a pop Dumbo because Dumbo is an elephant and I just wanted a little pop figure but they didn't have one so whatever but then we were at the pet store and he was telling me about the rats and all about them um he put, took one out and he was like this is um a special rat and it has Dumbo ears and I was like Dumbo it's my Dumbo I found my Dumbo like because their ears are on the side of their head and they look like Dumbo's ears and they're not on the top of their head so they really look like Dumbo's ears and I was like that's perfect like that's literally just like really ironic and it's just like everything happens for a reason you know like I didn't find a Dumbo pop figure but I found my little Dumbo rat <laughs> and the other one's name is Joseph um my favorite hockey player ever is Matthew Joseph so why not just name him Joseph so yeah that was like my exciting day I don't even know like I'm just really happy because I love it. I also got them some treats. These are little blueberry treats. And then this is the food that I got them. Just like that. Update. I've finally taken Dumbo out. Because they were sleeping for a long time and then they still weren't coming out very much. So... I thought I'd just bring them out and see 
if he likes me. Trying them to feed I'm trying to feed him this little blueberry treat, but he hasn't seemed to want to eat lately. Well since he's gotten here. But we're just laying on the couch. He's just exploring. I don't I'm like so scared to lose him. Well. That was my dog. And Joseph's in there somewhere. Buddy. There's no baby Joseph. Hey buddy. They're starting to come out now and it's so cute. Joseph loves the food. Dumbo hasn't really eaten. So yeah, that was my adventure today, and I have to cut this video short. I was going to talk more, but my camera is running out of memory. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog, like haul kind of video. I don't even know, but um, yeah, I really had a great day, and I hope you guys did too. So I'll see you guys in my next video. See ya!